for tuning in. My name is Nikki. Let's go ahead and get started on this beat. Okay, so here I'm using a primer. You definitely need a primer to prime your face. That way your makeup will last all day. I'm going in with my Morphe foundation. Uh, this foundation is really good. It's definitely buildable and it has full coverage, which I really like. All right, now I'm going in with my concealer as well as my contour uh, color. And this is by NYX. And now I'm just blending it out. You want to make sure you blend your lighter areas before you blend your darker areas. All right, now I'm going in with my Airspun setting powder and translucent. And I'm just going to put that under my eyes. I'm going to go ahead and place that under my nose, my chin, as well as my forehead and my nose. All your highlighted areas, you're going to put that in there. And this just sets your foundation, sets your concealers, so they last all day. Now you see me going in with my Black Radiance Contour Palette using an angled brush in the color Sculpt. And I'm just going to contour my face now. All right, now you're gonna go in with an eyeshadow primer and this light brown color or any color that's closest to your skin complexion. And you're gonna go ahead and blend that in. This is gonna be your transition color. That way when you're blending your other colors, they just look good. Now you're gonna go in with a red brick color and blend that in as well. And I'm taking my ebony pomade, which is very creamy, and I'm putting that on my lid, just carving it out. Just for anybody wondering, I also use this color on my eyebrows. Now I'm going in with a brown uh, shade, darker brown shade, and I'm putting that on top of that pomade. Now I'm taking another dark brown shade and I'm just packing on this color just to get it very dark. So all I'm doing is building browns right now and blend. Make sure you blend everything out. That's definitely the trick of makeup, making sure you blend. With a reddish brown color now, you're just gonna take that and blend it out. This is another setting powder. This is by NYX. I'm gonna use this in, whoa. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take this and blend everything out because I had a lot of fallout. All right, now with a black and brown shade, you're gonna go ahead and place that on top of your lid. Remember when I said we were gonna, head, gonna go ahead and build those browns? That's what I'm doing here because I wanted it really dark. So I'm taking a black eyeshadow and packing that on. And now you can see that we have the smoky effect going on. And blend, blend, blend. Don't forget to blend. All right, now you're gonna go ahead and dust away all of that powder. And I'm coming back with my completed eye. Also going into this orange shade and I'm just blending it out in my crease as well as my uh, lid just to blend everything out some more. Get my eyeliner in gold and I'm just lining my entire lid with it. That way it's gonna create that, uh, that deep crease. Now you're gonna go into the, a purple shade as well as a brown, and you're just gonna blend that into your crease. That just makes your deep crease stand out. And I'm taking a black eyeliner as well as mascara and placing that on my eye, and of course. Just keep going. All right, if you mess up, you can always just go in and blend. Blend it out until you can't see it no more, but you wanna make sure that the Bonita spot is Bonita Lash. Comes in this pretty packaging. Okay. 
and I saw these lashes on my website at NikkiCosmetic.com. You're going to go ahead and apply them. And now I'm taking that brown shade and applying that at the bottom of my eyelid. Just to smoke it out some more. The orange as well as this darker reddish brown color that we used earlier. And you're just going to put that under your lid out. and blend. And smoke it up. And the black as well. Yeah. All right, we got some fallout. I'm just gonna go back in with my air spun. Use what I have on my top. A little bit of this new pattern. You can brush it. It is up to you. So now we're going to mascara put some mascara at the bottom lashes oh. put some mascara on your bottom lashes these are my favorite lashes that i own these are bonitas they are perfect for any occasion I wear them in the daytime. I wear them at nighttime. It goes with natural looks. If you want to do something more dramatic like this one, it just makes your eyes really pop. So lastly, we're just going to take this angle brush and go into the champagne color. And I just want to put it right in the front of my oh yeah as you can see it has really brightened it up okay just going to drag it underneath there as well just so it connects but you want to make sure you blend it okay something i personally like to do to my eye eye looks okay it just makes your eyes pop, it brings them out. And if you wanna go in and just blend it with that brush we had earlier, just so everything is blended, you can do so. And now I'm just gonna go back in with that contour brush, cause you always wanna make sure everything is blended, okay? I usually do, even though it was pretty much blended already, but I just like to go over it one more time okay i'm gonna add some highlight this beautiful gold okay and you just want to highlight your cheek the top of your cheeks okay your nose i like to take it here and my chin okay can also take it under your eyebrows okay something real subtle and pretty all right now for the dramatic lip I'm gonna take the lip liner and plum and my lips it's very pigmented Perfect color for the fall. Yeah. And it's super creamy. Super creamy. Okay. You could wear this color alone. This is exactly what I was looking for. Okay, so we're gonna go in with Mold Wine. This is a velvet matte lipstick that will be launching on the 23rd of this month. Very moisturizing, pigmented, and it's very long lasting. So we're gonna go ahead and top this on top of that plum lip liner. And this is the perfect color, okay? And mind you, I did not moisturize my lips before I put this on. 
so pretty and it's buildable you're gonna keep going in I feel like you just put none but Carmex on your lips okay super pretty bomb for the fall okay and that is all that's basically it so okay y'all make sure y'all set y'all face especially if you're going out make sure y'all set y'all face you don't want to forget that okay now your face looking like skin and this is pretty good it's by milani make it last i think it was like eight dollars and you can't beat that so whoever told you you cannot slay with drugstore live okay so this is the final look. right this is the final look this look was inspired by honestly this lipstick this lippy is plum by nikki cosmetic and the velvet matte lipstick is called mauled wine you will be able to purchase both of these products on NikkiCosmetic.com. The plum liner is actually out now and the mold wine will be out on the 23rd of October. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoy.